What's up guys, Benji here, and today I'm bringing you a news radar special. Do -do 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 -do. Yeah, that's the uh, special noise. So, as you can tell from the title of this video, there is a new Counter-Strike game slash expansion coming out. It's going to be called Counter-Strike Global Offense, or Counter-Strike Go as it's been shortened to. And this is really, really interesting as Counter-Strike hasn't really had any update for quite a while, I don't think. You know, I don't know when the last update was, but I'm pretty sure it hasn't been for a while. Uh, the player's still been playing the old, same old Counter-Strike and obviously dedicated fans, but now they'll have something else to look forward to. The expansion will be released in early 2012, and it's going to be available on the PlayStation Network, Xbox Live, Steam, that's PC and Mac, and I'm not sure, but most of the stuff I'm about to tell you, it's available on PSP Go as well. So a couple of details to do with the actual uh, expansion pack is it's going to have... Um, it's going to have some new maps, new characters, and new weapons. And it's also going to include content for the old Counter-Strike games. It's going to have updates for those, so I don't know if there are any glitches on the maps. I don't really play Counter-Strike too often, but I'm guessing those kind of things are going to get looked looked at with the new expansion pack for the old maps, for the old game, sorry. Uh, so obviously, yeah, in the new maps, there's going to be new characters and new guns. Uh, I'm really, really looking forward to this. I think I might have to pick it up. Maybe make some videos of it if you guys want to see it. Another thing that's been announced for the uh, expansion pack is that there's going to be some new game modes that will be available as well. Now that sounds really, really exciting to me as the old Counter-Strike games tended to have the same old game types. I didn't really go on modded servers or anything like that. I just played the same old game. Obviously, I'm not knocking it or anything. It is a good game, but obviously the new game types are going to be really interesting. If they can have, like, Domination or... I don't know, sir, well, there is already a search kind of game type, isn't there? Capture the flag, all that kind of stuff. Then obviously it's going to add to the game even more. It's also going to include leaderboards and special types of matchmaking. So leaderboards, I don't think there were leaderboards in Counter-Strike Source. If there was, I don't think I paid too much attention to them. Not like Black Ops where your stats is basically how you are judged as a player. And if there is like a proper decent leaderboard, then obviously it's going to help track your stats and you'll be able to access them more easily and obviously anyone else will be able to access them. So that's pretty much it for the new uh, Counter-Strike Go as it's been shortened down to. Uh, thank you for watching the video guys, this was just a short little update. I'll see you next week with a full commentary. Counter-Strike Go is available early 2012. Thanks for watching once again and I will see you later. Alright now, wasn't that fun? Let's try something else.